Hello everybody and welcome to the brand spanking new gameplay that I am going to be taking you through. Uh, it's Dark Souls 3. I am Coconius of Robot Bimp. And I have been gone for a long ass time and I apologize, but school is uh, number one. You know, it's the most important thing. So, um, I've been, I've been kicking my own ass to keep my grades up and to do well and I've done just that, so... I'm sorry that it's been a long time since I posted a video. Sorry I haven't finished a single series, but this is the series we are going to finish. I'm a huge fan of the Dark Souls series and Bloodborne. Never played Demon Souls. Uh, never beat the first one. Beat the second one. Anyway, all that out of the way. Uh, I'm really excited to be back, and uh, I'm really excited to get going. So let's just uh, let's just let's go. Also, thank you to uh, the other half of Robot Bimp, Keith, for this game. Uh, so without him, I wouldn't be playing this. So thank you. The transitory lands of the Lords of Cinder converge. In venturing north. These guys look like a Dark Souls version of the cover of the Led Zeppelin 4 album. Or Zoso, whichever you prefer. Oh, good night. When the link of fire is threatened, the bell tolls. Unearthing the old lords of cinder from their grave. A gooey poop monster. That's where he is. These guys look pretty awesome. And this guy looks really fucking awesome. Does he only have one arm? Looks like his other arm is gone. Yeah, well, uh, that makes that an easy fight. <laughs> Jesus. What a frickin' intro. The Lords will abandon their thrones. And the unkindled will rise. Nameless, accursed, undead. Unfit even to be cinder. And so it is that Ash seeketh embers. Hmm. So the focus of this game appears to be like fire and cinder and embers, and whereas the first one was um, like humanity. And I forget what this was. The second one, humanity, also. I feel like it was. I I could be I could be wrong on that. So uh, we're gonna get through this character creation rather quickly. Uh, we'll we'll do our standard, cock Aeneas. Um, I'm a male, so we'll stick with the male. We'll do mature. I don't, you know, uh, class. I always gotta do deprived. Uh, cause it's. Fuck, I mean, look at him. He's naked. It's hilarious to be beating the game early with nothing. I'm going to pick the life ring. This is a semi-blind playthrough. Um, I started recording, and it got all muffed up, and um, 
I did like the first section. It's not, I didn't get very far. So, uh, let's do appearance. Just to put things out on the, you know, full disclosure, you know, put that on the table. Um, so voice, I want aged because <laughs> it was funny. Body hair, thick. Because that'll, that you know, you need that. That's actually essential to, to the game. Um, in case any of you are, you know, new to the series. Thick body hair is a must for a completion of the game. Um, I'm just going to do the quick stuff here. I've already done this. Uh, frustratingly so, I have to do it again. So what a similar face. Oh. Oh. They're just kind of like cookie cutters. Features, don't care. Face shape, oh my god. I mean, you could mold, like, the exact character you want with all this stuff they have. I'm gonna do this because it most closely resembles what I have, but not exa you know. I don't look like that, guys. I want you to know that. I guess I kinda do. Um, hair doesn't matter, because I'm gonna do, uh... Buzzed anyways. Beard color... I'm gonna custom because I kind of have a reddish beard with blonde hair. Okay, it's not really. Oh yeah, you can do this. Full red. It doesn't look like it's changing, does it? No, it's not. Huh. Well. This, was, this happened... Oh, no. The game is... Is the game crashing? It might be. Okay. Well, we'll find out. Ooh. Well, this is important, too. You want to have long eyelashes because... Yep. That's the end of that sentence, actually. So... Okay. Well, this, uh... Sure. Hopefully game... Okay. Game's not crashing. Good. Is it? No. Okay, good. For whom the bell tolls. Just kidding. Just kidding. Hell's bait. No. No. What other bell songs are there? Hell's bait. No. This is literally how I feel when I wake up on a daily basis. So, look at my hairy ass body. It's awesome. Freaking awesome. <laughs> look at this guy. Nobody is afraid of this guy. I'm, I gotta go fight this giant. And this is what I'm rolling up to him with? I mean, <laughs> I wouldn't be afraid. Ah! Oh shit! Hitting him with the heavy, right in the back. Oh, that god! The thought of getting hit in the back like that with a club makes my back hurt. My lower back hurt. Something fierce. All right. Um. Okay. Oh, swing and a miss. Oh ah, uh, hey. Okay. Ash and Estes Flask. Now, I want to make sure I fully explore all these areas before I leave them. To make sure I don't miss anything good. I think there's a thing I don't want to fight down this way, I think. Yeah. Yeah, is this the deep water? Yeah, not yet. Not yet. We'll come back to that. And if, uh, you've probably already seen it if you've, uh, played or seen. Oh, look at that block. I wouldn't even locked onto him either. That was, like, all that's straight skill. That's all that was. And, uh, you, that can't be taught. And that was also straight skill to get hit by that. Because you gotta let them feel comfortable. You gotta let them think they have control of the fight. And, uh, to get hit shows, shows it's just that. So, so, yeah. I, uh, I'm just doing what I'm supposed to be doing. You could learn a thing or two from watching me play this, you know? Prof this is a professional. I don't know if I meant... Did I mention that? This is a professional gameplay uh, playthrough, so... 
just, uh, you know, be aware of that. You're gonna learn a lot of things. You're gonna learn a You might want to sit there with a note. No, nope, notebook. Note. Is there somebody down there? I knew that already. Did you? See how I didn't stop at the bonfire? Pro tip. Pro tip. Write it down. <laughs> See how I run through like an idiot with my shield up? Oh boy. Oh, there's more people. Oh man, this might have been a mistake. Just kidding. I don't make mistakes. Oh no. <laughs> That's actually part of the strategy. So just bear with me here. This is, uh... All falling into place the way I planned it. See? You see? Now I'm in control. Okay. I'm stuck on a... Okay, there we go. Souls retrieved. See? See? Everything's fine. This guy... Look it. Don't even have time to react. I'll, I didn't want to lose those sweet, like... How many souls did I have? Like 120 before I died? Ugh. Backstabbery. Um... This guy's just kind of meandering on me, huh? Yeah. Okay. It's pretty, uh, pretty good. Going good so far. For being a <laughs> naked man in a loincloth. Not, not too shabby. Oh, fuck. I missed. Alright. Uh, boom. Dodge that. Check this out. Ah! <laughs> Wild man! Okay, well, uh, this looks like as a good as place, a, little, a good a place as any, uh, to stop here. To stop now. And, uh, cause, I mean, I think we all know what's gonna happen in this room when I go in there. And if you don't, well, then you're going to have to stick around and find out next time. But uh, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you for watching. And I will uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Later.